What's going on everybody? Welcome back to a breaking news story and we have more players that are pulled out of the French Open on the men and the women's side and there's some big names that were actually contenders going into the French Open which is happening next week. Let's go have a look at the list. Starting with the ATP, we have Balash, he's pulled out. Chorich, Edmund, Kyrgios, Pospisil's also pulled out. Denis Shapovalov has pulled out with a shoulder injury which is probably the biggest shock on the men's side considering how good he had been on the clay in 2021 and he just made the Geneva final last week so he's out out of the French Open and Stan Wawrinka is also missing the event for 2021. Having a look at the women that are pulled out of the French Open, we have Flipkins. She's pulled out. Simona Halep is pulled out, which is another big one. Pulled out with a left calf injury. And she is always a serious contender at any slam, especially the French Open. So she's not going to be playing. Sam Stoes is pulled out. Strickov is pulled out. And Yastremska is also pulled out because she is still on a provisional suspension. So there you have it. They are the names that are pulled out of the French Open. Like I said, big names like Shapovalov. He's had a great season almost beat Rafa in Rome a couple of weeks ago. And Halep, of course, she's always a contender. World number three, she's the most high-profile player not to be playing the French Open. But there are some players that are under injury clouds. Ash Barty, she was injured a couple of weeks ago. Bianca Andreescu also pulled out last week from a tournament with injury as well. So we've got to wait and see with those players. But there are some big names that are not playing. But we have the big names that are playing. So the top 10 of the men, they're all playing. And besides Halep, the top 10 of the women are also on the cards and ready to play. But let me know down in the comments below, who are you most excited to be watching at the French Open because, like I said, we've got a couple of players that aren't playing, but there are big names that are playing. So let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win the French Open and who are you most excited to watch? So the French Open, it's only a couple of days away, but it's going to be missing some key players.